What's up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter. And a lot of people been asking me about the violence in Chicago. You know, I want to share something with you guys that I think is super crazy. A lot of people been asking me about the shootings and the murders that's just happening in Chicago. This at an all-time high. Yesterday actually was damn near record-breaking. Think about this. A lot of guys and a lot of people don't understand how serious and how uh, strong the momentum is with the killings and the blickers. They're everywhere. Everybody got one. Uh, from last night at 8.30, from last night to 8.30 this morning, a 12-hour period, it was over 14 people shot, five people killed, okay? Four people shot and killed, one person beaten to death. So I want you guys to understand this. In the 12-hour period, it was five people checked out of Chicago. Now, that's not even the crazy part that makes you want to clamor all on it. Um, it was actually one person from east side that died yesterday till this morning. It was a person that lost his life on the west side, east side, south side, and north side. And then someone was beaten to death. It just shows you that the violence is everywhere. It's all around the communities. It's in every neighborhood. Don't matter where you're at. You ain't really safe unless you're in one of those upscale communities. And it can still happen to you there. Just probably not at a rate that it happens in the community. I'm not sure exactly what it is, man. You know, people voting. I'm not sure if it's the voting that's going to help uh, bring the, the crime down. I'm not exactly sure what it's going to be, man. But I can tell you this here. Chicago is becoming a warfare a battle zone, you know, a gang field where the murders and the killings is just out of hand. Everybody killing. The killings is covering the whole states, the whole city. You could be at a bus stop. You could be on the E-way. You could be leaving somewhere. Ain't no place safe. I want to tell you guys something that I don't think a lot of people understand. And, you know, we can't do it like this. You know, the days are just riding pairs, doing drive-bys, shooting people, houses, killing innocent kids. We ain't going to stand for that no more. We got to band together. We understand this is such thing as street shit. So we're going to let street shit stay street shit. But you know when some shit, some whole shit. And we ain't letting whole shit slide. We're going to treat whole niggas like whole niggas. You understand what I'm saying? So it's time for us to come together the same way we came together with the snitch K movement and and no talking. We got to come with the movement of the no killing the kids no more. No blindfold shooting. No more covering your eyes blicking. It's time for us to get grown and get bigger than this. You got a problem with your op. You walk up on them, man. And I ain't saying that's a good thing, man. Because to be honest with you, if you want to get to heaven, it depends on how you're living when you're here on earth. You know, I always tell people this here, man. Um, it's the life that you live in. Uh, is you happy with it? You know, is you is you is you OK with the life that you live in? Give me a yes or no. I want to ask you guys right now. You answer this question for me, man. Is the life that you live in a life that you happy with? If you was to end up losing your life today, would you be happy with the life that you live? I ain't saying it got to be the best life, but would you be happy with the life that you live? Cool. You answer that question. Now, I got a question for you. If you were to die today. With the closest people that's closest to you, you know, the closest three people. You come up with three people that's the closest to you. Would they be happy with the way you lived your life? You know what I'm saying? Would they be happy with the way you treated them, with the way, you know, you lived around them, with your energy, with your presence, with your spirit? You know what I'm saying? You feel me? Answer that question for me. It's the homie two tell the street reporter. Blah, 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 blah.